super cool party people and welcome to the vlog it is saturday it is about 7 30 and i'm up and i'm moving and i'm getting ready to go to work which is super exciting the internet is down for some reason and i cannot reconnect and so i guess i have to go up upstairs i have to go downstairs to deal with that because like nothing's connecting which is suspicious um so i guess it just needs a quick reboot hopefully i don't know it's weird like i tried to use my ipad to give my phone the password because it was saying passwords wrong and it was like password still wrong and i was like hmm and now everything's off the internet so yeah we shall see anyways that's the most exciting thing to happen this morning like I said, I'm going into work now, so I need to finish getting ready. I think I'm just going to leave the camera at home because I'm working with someone today, and so that's just weird. I also think it's going to be a long day. So, you know what? It is what it is, and I will just see you after. Well, it is a time. It is quarter to four. I worked for almost seven hours today. I mean, technically it's a little bit more because of lunch. So I was there for like seven hours, 15 minutes, but you don't get paid for lunch, so whatever. Anyways, I was there for a long time. <sighs> Got a lot done, feeling a lot better. I'm still gonna go in tomorrow um, just to shore everything up, just trying to decide if I need a secondary person tomorrow. Just, you know, put my mind at ease that everything is done. So we will see. My body is hurting today a lot, like my butt. <laughs> Do you know how much you use your butt muscles for things? It's a lot. But yeah, just before I finished working, my aunt texted. She's like, oh, do you want to come for dinner today? I was like, can I do my laundry at your house? <laughs> and she's like, yeah. And then she told me the time. I was like, oh, no, I have time to do laundry. So I'm doing laundry right now. Hopefully that will all go smoothly. And there'll be a machine ready because it's like down to the wire. We'll see. Anyways, I'm going to make my bed, I think. And then take a look at my list and see what I should be working on. And... I don't know, I'm just like, I've been out of sorts the last week-ish, I would say, and um, yeah, it hasn't really got much better, but we will see. I got some time now, so hopefully I get some stuff done. I did nothing yesterday because I ended up working much longer than I anticipated, and then D&D, &D and blah. so I'm going to take a look at my list, see what I can accomplish today, and then just kind of go from there. I'm really glad that I finished editing my book early this month because that was a major goal to accomplish by the end of the month and I finished early, so that is good. But <sighs> I'm just gonna ramble, so I'm, I'm gonna go. <laughs> my hair is so greasy right now, it is disgusting, but it looks kind of cute with all that curl. I'm gonna try to figure out a way to put it up because we cannot operate with how greasy this is. And I don't use dry shampoo because a lot of aerosol sprays like that cause me to just have a massive allergic reaction. So, I mean, I guess I could find some powder ones, but, you know, it's fine. I'm going to shower. Mm, I'm probably going to have a bath tonight when I get home, just like with Epsom salt, so my body will stop hurting, and then probably shower tomorrow after one more day of work, because then I'm off for a couple days, which will be nice. Yeah, so, that's what we're doing. I put on some very natural makeup. You, like, can't tell. That's pretty good. Anyway, um, <laughs> I've done, other than start my laundry and just switch it over, I have done nothing since I last picked up the camera, because <laughs> I just, like, well, I mean, I, but yeah, so, uh, I'm just looking at my list, and I'm trying to figure out how to prioritize it properly, because life things have changed, and I need to modify it around that, so, that's where we're at. God, my hair feels disgusting. Um, so I think I'm just going to put on the last episode of Survivor Cook Islands, which I <laughs> haven't watched again for like another five days, and then just uh, slowly start to go to town. But like I need to do things like I need to take out my garbage. I need to I don't need to have like six bags of chips in my room, so I need to bring them downstairs, etc. I know this is very fascinating, but it is what it is. Alrighty, so I'm home now. It is 20 after 10 and my cousin's cousin ended up being over and I had no idea because she lives uh, in Vancouver and it was just so great to see her because it's been like forever, like 2017 summer I think is the last time I saw her when her and her sister and their mom, I believe too, <laughs> was over and like, I mean, in all fairness, it's like my cousin's cousins, but we're just, we're, we're, we're all cousins. We're all good. So that was fun. Uh, we had 
a nice spaghetti dinner and then my one cousin left to go hang out with some of her friends my cousin's girlfriend left and so us three cousins played a bunch of crazy eights my one cousin decided that she wanted to draw Post Malone's tattoos on her face, so she, on her face, so she did. <laughs> and then we we're like, oh, we we're playing Crazy Eight Count now, which goes on forever. And then we we're like, I can really go for a Frosty. And so the three of us hijacked one of the cars, and we went and we got Frosties, and it was so good, and it was so nice. And I wish I'd brought a camera, but I was like, I didn't know she was gonna be there, because I feel like she'd be more into being on camera but whatever it's fine anyways i'm gonna go jump in the bath now because my butt hurts <laughs> in case you didn't know you don't realize like how much you use those like upper gluteus maximus muscles i have no idea what they're called but like those muscles until you need to do things like stand and walk they do a lot anyway bath time now with some epsom salts <sighs> deal with that later oh so much laundry and um yeah we'll see we'll see how we go oh i don't i don't think i showed this but i got an order from amazon and it's these disney postcards and they are like so adorable i love them some of it is like concept art it's pretty cool anyways i'm gonna send a million people postcards but before i do that i'm gonna go jump in the bath Alrighty, so i'm still sore i don't really think the bath did anything i read for a bit so that was exciting it seems that our heroes are not doing very well. Obviously, it'll turn around. And then it's now midnight. I am so tired. Like, all the bath did was exhaust me. It did not help with the pain. It just made me so, so tired. So, I'm just gonna go to sleep. I'm not gonna add this vlog. I'm not gonna get up early tomorrow because I'm so tired. Um, so, we'll just figure it out tomorrow, I guess. I just, like, I feel like... I am in a state of my life is in a mess. It's not, I'm being overdramatic, but just like my room is a mess. For the last couple days, I haven't been hitting my goals. I haven't been studying my Japanese. Today was the first day I've read in like four days or five days. I don't, it's been a while. So I just like, it's, and I mean, it's obvious. <laughs> On days when I don't work, it's really easy to get everything done. On days when I only work four hours, it's pretty easy to get everything done. On days when I work anything more than four hours, which is like most normal people work like eight hours a day, and like I'm being such a whiny baby, but it's really hard to get stuff done. And so, especially as we're getting busier at the theater, I probably need to like make priorities or stuff. Like days when I work eight hours, these are the th tasks I will shoot for days when I don't work these are them days when I work for you know like so I don't just have these high expectations because like I put the same expectation on myself to get stuff done whether I don't work or whether I work eight hours and that is not feasible because that's like an eight hour time gap where I can't do anything and even if it's just an extra four hours that's four hours where I can't do anything so that's we're just having epiphanies this year like crazy like the first one in january like oh it's okay to set goals and not reach them even if you try your hardest second one don't expect more from yourself than you're able to produce we're, we're doing well i knew that this year was going to be a year of growth one of my words up on the board is growth so that is good but i'm exhausted i'm going to sleep i'm taking care of me tonight Tomorrow is going to be a very busy day. I'm working for four to six to eight hours. I don't know yet. Um, I have to grocery shop. I have to put away my laundry. I want to tidy my room. I need to edit this vlog. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff I need to do. So that's fine. Tomorrow we will get our act together and get ready solid for this next hectic week. It's going to be hectic. It'll be fine. <laughs> Literally, I'm such a mess that I was like, it'll be fine. That's how I end the vlog. It is not. Uh, with that, <laughs> I am, I'm just gonna say, I'm gonna say it, I'm gonna say it. Thank you so much for coming along on today's adventure, and I will see you tomorrow when we hopefully figure things out. <laughs> Good night. Good afternoon, super cool party people, and welcome back to the vlog. It is Sunday afternoon, and yes, I am combining vlogs, days, whatever. Not because I don't think I had enough footage yesterday, but I don't think I had a ton, but mostly because... I'm just a mess <laughs> and last night like I said I was so tired I did not want to edit I did not get up early because I did not want to edit this morning because I was tired I did not sleep well last night either so it was a good call and then I went to work and just worked four hours it is 
10 after 12 now. I just got home and it's just everything's been hectic. I got a little bit sick or under the weather or whatever it was last week and that kind of threw everything off because I was going to work Wednesday, Thursday and then I ended up going in Friday, Saturday, Sunday instead and then tomorrow, let's announce it, I'm going to Blind Channel for like 36 hours or something stupidly short. So not only do I like need to get my life together but I also need to pack and I'm going out and then when I come back in on Wednesday, I'm going straight to work at the theater. <sighs> so we're feeling like a bit of a mess. And not only that, we are looking like a mess. I never let my desk get this bad. I need to take out my garbage and then just that and that. It's bad. And so I have a million things to do today. I have to pack. I had to do like the majority of my tasks that I would normally do on Tuesday at the theater I had to do them today which was like the main reason I had to go in today <sighs> and anything else that I couldn't get done I'll just do on Wednesday when I go in like but it's just it's a lot and I like I feel like a mess you know like I always joke about how like oh I'm a mess but I'm really usually not too much of a mess it usually takes like five minutes to get back in order but right now like there's bags of chips on the floor there's that are empty there's bags of chips in bags that are just needing to be put somewhere that is not in my room it's just it's bad so today's gonna be a busy day the nice thing is is i'm not leaving for blind channel until about one o'clock tomorrow it'll just depend when the crew boat comes into town that i can jump on on the way to go back but there's still a lot to do i was gonna go grocery shopping with my mom's boyfriend when we got off work because i pulled him in with me again to work today because there's so much to do at the theater but then he got called for his other job, so he has to go work there tonight. So can't go grocery shopping. My mom is about to head to work, so that's going to have to wait till later. But I need to buy groceries to feed on over like the next couple days while I'm out in Blind Channel. And so my plan is just to make a big batch of spaghetti sauce and just bring that out because that'll cover my two dinners. Because I only have two dinners. I'm out on Monday at about 1 o'clock. Tuesday, we're setting up the new POS. That's why I'm going out. Hopefully we'll get everything done. Wednesday I'm leaving Blind Channel at like 6 in the morning to get back because it's a haul out day and plus I have to work. And then if we don't get everything done then I might have to go back. So it's just my week drastically changed and so I have a million things to do. Am I rambling? Yes, I am rambling but I'm a little bit stressed. So step one though before anything else. I have a list written which is great. I wrote it yesterday. It has like a billion things to do on it. <laughs> But that's fine. That's also kind of part of the reason that I'm not editing this vlog because did you get that? That was really garbled English. That's also part of the reason that I'm not editing this vlog is because that is time that I could use doing other things like freaking out like I'm currently doing. Um, I'm gonna eat first. I think that's key to success. Gonna make myself a nice lunch and then we're gonna tackle this. <sighs> oh I'm gonna change first though. Get into some comfy dare I say it, pajamas. Maybe pajamas, we'll see. I'm gonna get into some comfy clothes and we're just gonna tackle this one step at a time after I first eat the food. I do have nap on my list for today, but I don't know if I have time or actually I'm not really, I don't know if I need it. I'm not as tired as I thought I would be when I went to sleep last night. So yeah, let's do this. Alrighty, so here's the situation. I cooked and ate lunch and then I came up, I'm like, I'm just gonna watch a YouTube video and lay down for a bit because I worked and I'm tired and then I was like I'm really tired maybe I should have a nap so I set alarm to have a nap and I did not sleep <laughs> I tried I did not sleep so I'm just as exhausted I was as I was well slurring words and um, I didn't even get any sleep so this is still the situation over there it's a disaster it's real bad so it is currently 20 to 4 I probably have about two and a half hours of cleaning time or organizing time or whatever the heck I'm going to do before I'm going to go to grocery shop. So what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to put something on my TV. At some point I need to find the plug-in for my Wii U uh, controller so I can watch Netflix on that without having to plug in my laptop up there. I mean it's nice to have but it's still annoying. But <laughs> I'm going to put something on and I'm just going to blitz I guess. We're just going to start doing things like I have to charge my mics for one like there is so much stuff I have to do so without further ado I'm just gonna do it <laughs> like a 
bird on a tree. I'm just sitting here. I got time. It's clear to see from up here. The world seems small. We can sit together. It's so beautiful, you and me. We meant to be in the great outdoors, forever free. Making progress, not the best, but all my clothes are folded. I just need to put them away, but I want to pick out what I'm going to be bringing with me first. Oh, this mic. I hope you heard me. I really want to do a video about the pros and cons of my tech, and one of them is this mic <laughs> whenever you want to turn the camera around. Anyway, <sighs> it's, it's getting better. I'm only going to be gone. I think I did the math. And I think I'm only going to be gone for like 43 hours, so it's like pajamas and like max two outfits kind of thing. Um, so I don't need to pack too, too much. I just, it's forecasting for snow there. <laughs> Why? <laughs> so yeah, and it's just always a little bit colder there anyways than it is here. So we'll be doing some long sleeves and probably sweatpants because there won't be too many customers around and it's... Yeah, because there's going to be a lot of scanning of things, so it's going to be getting up and down and up and down and up and down. So, yeah. Anyway, we're, we're getting there. I'm feeling a lot more put together, which is nice. Um, I'm still exhausted, though. I just, like, I don't know what it is. I'm so tired. Maybe I should, like, put on those, like, under eye gel things. Maybe those will help. Oh, I forgot I can't really whisper as much with this mic. <laughs> uh, like, first world problems. I know. Anyway. I am now going to take a look at my list because I've just kind of been going with the things I knew I needed to do, like find the floor, step one. Um, so I'm going to take a look at my list. I think next I'll probably be setting up my agenda because next week is going to be hectic, like 43 hours in blind channel and then right back into work and then potentially right back to blind channel. <laughs> Who am I? Anyway, so that's where we're at. It's, I've still got, like, Amazon packages here that I need to break down. I just, I don't even know what's going on. I do. Things aren't going well. <laughs> That's what's going on. But I am getting my life together, so I need to switch around my attitude, too. It's like, <sighs> I don't know. It's just, if you feel like your life is falling apart and you just go, yep, my life is falling apart, it's just going to keep feeling like it's falling apart. So I just need to rally and be like, let's get this done. Let's do this. It's five to five. Tick tock, tick tock. It's fine. We still have like 20 hours until departure time. It'll be fine. I just feel like I have a lot to do. And I do. So we're going to need to cut some things out, I think, and make things priorities. So packing, I need to charge a bunch of things, like make sure my GoPro is charged and all that. And then set up my agenda etc. Maybe I'll start plugging things in. That seems like a solid plan. Like a bird on a tree. Alrighty, so I did my eye things under eye masks and I feel slightly more human. I also got all my clothes away which is exciting and I've picked my clothes to wear tomorrow. My desk is mostly clear just starting to pick up some tech stuff to bring. And yeah I'm making progress. I even changed into other clothes uh, which is exciting. My mom and I are gonna go for dinner here I think. I think go shopping. I think she's just about home from work and I have prioritized the things that I need to do. 
Oh, I have something on here that I didn't write down that I should write down. Anyways, shower, start packing, cook the spaghetti sauce before I go and grocery shop. Those are without a doubt 100% the things that I do want to do. There are other things I would like to do as well if I have time, but we will see. I also kind of want to do invoicing today because like this week coming up is a very busy week and if I'm out there working on the POS, I'm obviously not going to have time to work on the invoicing. So yeah, <laughs> invoicing would be great today, but I don't have to be at the dock until about one. Invoicing tonight would be great, but I don't have to be at the dock until like one o'clock tomorrow, give or take. I'm gonna have to just kind of monitor it as the day goes on. I'm hoping that, I mean, it'd be great if it was Strudel's mom coming because I have her cell number, so I wouldn't even have to text her to be like, oh, hey, ETA. <laughs> but I don't think it's gonna be either of my bosses because they've got interviews tomorrow. And it could be the guy that lives on the boat that we always go on to, the Share Bear, um, which would be awesome, but I don't think I have a cell number. So it'd be great if it was Strudel's mom because that's easy. Um, but if it's, and also like the ride back, either her or the dude on the Share Bear be like aces because like I know them so well. I mean, my boss is fine too, but I don't think they would. Um, <laughs> but like if it's the other water taxi skipper who's a great guy but it's just like it wouldn't be it wouldn't be the same it's not like family the other two are like family they're the rest are like family he's he, I've only like he started at the end of August or beginning of September when I was out there so like I kind of got to know him and then he was there for a little bit when I was there in October because he was on and off and like he's a great guy he is hilarious his laugh is like the greatest laugh ever great guy but again i don't know him as well as i know the others who i've known for like three years now it's not family anyways i'm just rambling now i'm just i'm hoping for hans who is the share bear dude <laughs> i'm hoping for hans because i haven't seen hans since september oh my mom's home i should probably stop rambling i'm gonna go well hello that's really bright significant time has passed. It is, wow, it is 10 to 9. Last time I checked, it was like 8 o'clock, I swear. Anyway, had dinner, grocery shopped. I've cooked up my spaghetti sauce and mostly packed my food bag. I mean, obviously there's stuff in the fridge that I'll have to pack tomorrow, but feeling pretty good about that, which is nice. I have most of my toiletries packed, I believe. All the clothes, like I said earlier, laid out and my outfit for tomorrow, so that is good. And... We're making progress. It's slow progress for sure. And like my friend just texted me and was like, hey, do you want to write a blog post for this site? It's due Wednesday afternoon. And I was like, nope. <laughs> so sorry. But it's great that he was thinking about me because, you know, writing. But I don't like, I'm not really a nonfiction writer, especially like things where you have to research. Like I write my blog posts every day, but well, not every day. Sometimes I'm lazy and I don't, but I just, I just, I just write. I just do my thing. <laughs> anyway, you know, that'd be cool if I was into it. <laughs> also, another friend of mine was like, oh, hey, I'm going to send you this um, short story. Can you take a look at it for me? And yeah, obviously, this is, you know, it's a thing. But like, I'm just so busy. I can't say no. I have troubles. Actually, I said no to him. I was like, thanks for thinking about me, but no. Anyways, I am charging things. Did I just... Oh, I was like, this is, did I just leave it on the floor? So GoPro batteries are charged, so they are ready to go for tomorrow, which is exciting. I charged my headphones, and then I was like, well, maybe, like, smaller headphones would be smarter because it'll take up less room. But I do have to go straight to work on Wednesday, and I prefer my over the ear versus the in the ear. So we'll see. I don't know. I just, I'm overthinking, I'm sure. Just about knocked contact out there. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to jump in the shower because that is a key thing I need to do. And then when I get out of the shower, I'm going to take everything I don't need out of my backpack because I'm going to try to pack everything in my backpack. I'll probably put my laptop in my laptop case and then just I have a little cooler that I picked up at the store. It's like 14 bucks. It's like a 12 can cooler. And so it's significantly smaller than my 96 can cooler, which is normally what I bring when I'm going out there in the summer, uh, just with all my summer food, because we only shop once. That's what we're about. Um, so it should fit my 
two dinners, my lunch stuff, etc. My breakfast drinks. So yeah, we should be good. So that is where we're at. Talking about it now, it seems like I'm doing all right, but in my head, I'm looking at my list and I have the things that are highlighted, which are the important things. And a li I just have to put the stuff, oh, it says start packing. I have started packing. I just have to put that stuff away and then shower and then everything on my list is done. So it's not as bad as, as it seems. Yeah, so I'm gonna jump in the shower now, I guess, and I will check in with you afterwards when we're hopefully productive. Oh, so this, this ring light that I, ring light that I have, that was terrible ears. This ring light that I have, let's go again, uh, newer. I'll try to link it down below if I remember. I got it because this YouTuber, Alicia Marie, was like, oh, I got this and I love it. And I was like, oh my God, that's cute. And it's small. I still want to figure out a better way to store it on my desk here, but Overall, I'm very happy with it. When I was setting up my agenda earlier, I just like turned it down like that. So shining on my desk gave me a little bit extra light. It's great. I love it. So she did like a Amazon finds that I love and she put this in. I was like, yeah, girl, I got that because of you. So yeah, didn't use an affiliate link though. Haha, <laughs> because Canada. <laughs> Why am I rambling? This is, I swear this is part of the problem. <laughs> I can just like go off on these tangents. <sighs> Let's just take a deep breath, everybody. Just <sighs> I'm going to go now, and I'm gonna shower, and we're gonna be zen when we come back. I need to. One of the things I want to start doing this year was meditating, and it's because I think I need to. <laughs> so. Maybe next month. Maybe that can be the thing. No, I've already picked my thing for next month for my 30 days, but maybe April. April will be here soon enough. All right. Bye for now. It's 1030 and I don't know how that happened. I've been making progress though on nothing other than what was on my list. So my bag is probably half packed, I think. I can't pack any of my tech. Well, I can't pack all of my chargers and tech stuff until tomorrow, so just kind of leaving that. But I got all my clothes in there, all my toiletries, and yeah, that's all I got in there. But that's really all I need. And um, I'm like, am I going to have enough room? Am I going to run out? I don't know, because this camera is kind of large. <laughs> I think it'll be okay. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> anyway, <sighs> it is like, today did not go the way I hoped it would go, honestly. If we're being real, I thought I was going to come home and just like get everything done on my list, but it quickly became apparent that that was not going to happen, Ugh, which sucks. I hate it. I know that I should be like, Tiffany, it's fine. Like you need to take care of yourself, blah, 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 blah. But I'm like, girl, you should have got that done. Managing expectations. Not good at it. Anyways, I'm currently downloading a bunch of Netflix. Yeah, it's Brooklyn Nine-Nine. Tell me a bunch of Brooklyn Nine-Nine for while I'm out there because I fall asleep listening to shows or movies that I've seen a million times before so that I, um, my brain shuts off, which is super convenient. And, um, I sound sarcastic, but no, that's legitimately the only way I can fall asleep at night. Otherwise, my brain's just like, hey, remember that thing six years ago where you, like, tried to pull a push door? Let's think about that. It's fun. <laughs> anyway, that's where we're at right now. I'm probably gonna start to get ready for bed here soon. I just, I feel, I, there's a lot of stuff on my desk still, and I still feel, like, in shambles a little bit, just, like, claustrophobic from everything that needs to be put in places. So I'm gonna do that first. Uh, so I guess I'll check in with you just before bed now. Hopefully I'll be climbing towards bed around 11, but I might edit this tonight, so I don't know. We'll see. I'm conflicted. I think, honestly, I need to take like a week off of a lot of things <laughs> coming up here soon. So I might take like a week off of vlogging and like a week off of social media in general, just like zen. That's how I'm feeling. So we'll see how it goes. Anyways, let's... This half of the vlog was supposed to be about getting my life together, and it's really not. It's more about, like, ah! <laughs> anyway, with that, I'm so sorry if you're still watching this. It's been a mess. I'm aware. 
I'll check in with you later. Alrighty, so I've proceeded to do nothing for the last hour. It is 20 to 12 now. I apparently am losing my voice, but what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna upload all the footage, go to sleep, edit this in the morning because, you know, <sighs> my schedule's gonna be a little bit off anyways because I can't upload while I'm in blind channel, but that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> so with that, I'm going to say thank you so much for coming along on today's adventure and yesterday's, and I'll see you tomorrow where we get to go see puppies. Strudel! Strudel! <laughs> That's the only reason I'm going out, if we're being honest. <laughs> Good night.